I swear, I swear. There was a cart. There was a cart. So I'm not hiding. hiding. Sophie sees this person coming down the hallway. And he's like, from oh, the cart. She came from the cart. She's like, oh, there, there's a little coffee cart. They're coming down. So this lady comes in, opens our door, and she says something. In a language that we don't in know. Czech. In Czech. Or Polish. Either one. And Sophie goes, um, do you guys have any wine? No, <laughs> <laughs> exact words were, do you have any wine or do you just serve coffee? <laughs> and this poor lady probably recognizes those words, but like doesn't know any English. So she like asks again and then she goes, tickets? <laughs> Sophie's like, right. Tickets! We you need to see our tickets. <laughs> They've already checked our tickets twice today, so I didn't think it would be a third time. And there's a coffee cart. In Not the anymore. Hallway. I don't see it now. No. I don't know what it is. Anyway. Okay, we just got to our hostel in Prague, and we have a room all to ourselves. It's not a private room. It's not a private room, but we're the only ones in here. Every bed is unmade. Yeah. There's no one stuff in here. We literally have the room to ourselves. Life is good. Amazing. This is the first time we've gone to a hostel and not had to get ready in the dark. Mm -hmm. So yeah. That's so. a plus. Yeah. Yay. We've gotten ice cream. And it's these like chimney things. They're really good. Uh, hello, Frog. The last time I was here was four years ago for choir tour, so I'm reliving things right now. Oh, for sure, I'm gonna be jump scared, 100%. I will punch you. Okay, so it's like, I don't know, one-ish and we are honestly just killing time waiting for our two friends to show up because they are coming from London and Munich? Munich? Maybe, maybe. So now we're in the fortress. It starts with an V. I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah. Mm Yep, that was Sorry. absolutely the video. <laughs> My bad. Hello. Hi. Welcome hey. to Prague. We've already talked about Prague, but we have a new friend here now. This is Megan. Hi. She's joining us for the rest of the time <laughs> in Europe. Yep. New side character. Woohoo. Yeah, new side character I'm in the vlog. Sophie is it? I'm saying I'm a reoccurring character. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a reoccurring character. Right now. A, a special, special feature. Yeah. Special feature right You're now. For the rest of the season. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. So we just tried to find a hostel for our dear friend Megan for tomorrow night and there's literally not a single one. And why do you ask? Why is there not a single Airbnb hostel, hostel or hotel? Hostel, hotel, hostel in the entire single city. bed. Not a single bed. There are no beds in this city. One Airbnb. $700. In the middle of nowhere. Why do you ask? Because there is a national witch burning holiday where people come from the entire Czech Republic to Prague to do not one, not two, but multiple <laughs> witch burnings, burnings throughout the city. All around. And so everything is booked. Okay. Because they have to do some witch okay. burning. And they're not even happening until the day after. It's preparation season. I'm currently figuring out whether she's going to <laughs> spend like $700 in a hotel or sleep on the streets of Prague. <laughs> 
She's literally gonna pee. This man just assumed that we were drunk out of our minds. I just had to pee. This man was like, did you come from the party? And I was like, no, we came from dinner. And I almost pee my pants. Sophie, you're not paying attention. I'm very sorry. <laughs> Right now we're up in the Astrological Clock Tower, and I don't know if we reintroduced Taylor to the vlogs, Hi. This is but Taylor. Taylor's I'm back. back. She's in a feature for yeah, the for I the am. next like couple days. She's a feature side character. Yeah. What, what is that? I like a, like a guest? guest? Special guest. Special guest. Maybe no, started as special guest, but he, she's currently going to become a season regular. Yeah. I'm one of the main characters that left. Oh, oh this is your return. This is my yeah. yeah, return to the show. Yeah. Awesome. Doofenshmirtz Evil Incorporated. Look at that. So These are the guys that come out of the tower. Hello. So we thought we would just come grab our raincoats yeah, real quick. Um, and this is so the nice situation in the, the baggage room. Mm -hmm. So this is our first uh, overnight train in beds. <laughs> Welcome to Budapest. to Budapest this morning and we had a really nice train car we had to sleep yeah. in we actually had to like got to sleep in a bed like eight hours of sleep. it was fantastic yeah. they brought us breakfast in the morning so free felt, food felt very fancy yeah. we just dropped our bags off at our hostel and mm -hmm. now we're gonna go to the house of terror good first stop mm -hmm. yeah. so be Budapest, we have we have an really unlimited idea. Prosecco boat tour. There's said boat. No one gets hospitalized. Uh, is that a manifestation? I didn't say that. So yeah. Currently feeling very sober. <laughs> this is for the vlog. For like, yeah, Taylor Cam. You know, Brooklyn, Brooklyn Cam is when retired. You know, she's back in the States. We are so, so Taylor Cam. We got soap, we got Megan, we got wine bar, you know, we got our best one. That was fun. Yeah. Alright, bye, babe.
Now that I deleted a couple of things, I originally filmed this on Snapchat, but it deleted because I love my phone. We just got scammed, not scammed. We got kind of scammed. We got, we got fined on the tram system because we didn't buy tickets. There was nowhere to there was buy tickets. There was nowhere to buy tickets. Was nowhere to buy tickets. Even Literally. if you knew you had to have them, there was nowhere to get them. There was a stand inside the tram. And we're like, oh, okay, like, can we just buy tickets there? They're like, no. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. They're like, well, you got on without a ticket, but you buy tickets on. And then we're like, how does that make any yeah. sense? Yeah, so we just got fined $36. That's a lot to us about that one. Yeah. yeah. They were like, oh, it's going to be like 5000 Yeah, they're cranking it. And then they switch it. And they're like, no, it's 12000 And we kept funny. being like, oh, like, we literally didn't know. Like, yeah. we'll get off right now. Like, we're so sorry. Like, we really weren't trying to, like, do rude. Anything. Like, we will get off. We'll get off. And, and they were like, like, no. They tried to write in our passports. And we were like, that's not happening. Anyway, so we love, we love public transportation. Yeah. up again. <laughs> Sophie and I have been dying for a good 15 minutes and we can't stop laughing. now in Austria <laughs> I haven't really Belvedere done an Palace. update yeah Belvedere Palace I was actually here like four years ago on choir tour I didn't go inside any of these buildings which are now like art museums I just walked around this whole garden area today is a chill walking day tired yeah I feel like that's normally the size of tulips I've never seen them this big we all ran for it but Sophie did not make it Okay, so today is day two of Vienna and we are in the Schönbrunn Palace. I was also here four years ago, but it's still very, very, very pretty and it smells really good because everything's like blooming. Yeah, tonight we have, ooh, that was wet. That was fun. Nice, nice, nice. Tonight we have an overnight train to Venice, so. Fifth. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should, yeah, we should do more frolicking. We could have a picnic here. So you can hear me? Probably. I'll try again. Mm, that's nice. Thank you. <laughs> Megan's dressed like a tree today. <laughs> Spot the difference. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, bye-bye.
That was so rude, but I couldn't help but laugh. <laughs> There's a window. There's a window. The door has a window you could use to ask them yourselves. I can't get there in 10 minutes. Did he literally just say, open the window and ask? He goes, well, I can't be there in 10 minutes, but we have security cameras. And I'm like, so I let a serial killer into the hospital, but the hospital, <laughs> but the security cameras will let you know who he is. I didn't say that. And then he goes, well, the door has a window, so you can open it and ask him what he wants. <laughs> Um, turns out that it was in fact a guy who just didn't have the new code and didn't think to call to get a new code to get but his bag. He had a friend staying in the hostel and didn't think to text his friend, just decided to bang aggressively on the door like a serial killer. Over and over and over and over yeah. again. His friend invited him in and then was like, do you guys not hear me knocking? And you're like, well, we were we in our room. He was like, ah, oh, yeah. So it was a fun time. It was a fun time. Yeah. Now off to our train station again. <laughs> now that my adrenaline is skyrocketed. Yeah, literally.